Our meditation today comes from Job chapter 38. To give us an overview, Job was God-fearing before Almighty God. He was great, he was solid. And within the flash of an eye, he lost everything. But he maintained his fidelity before God. As we say in Trinidad, he didn't fly in God's face. He didn't disrespect and turn away from God. And after he went through his moments of agony, this is how God addressed him. Job must bow to the Creator's wisdom. Then, from the heart of the tempest, God gave Job this answer. So imagine this tempest, this storm is raging. And from the heart of it, God gave him this answer. Who is this obscuring my intentions with his ignorant words? words? Brace yourself like a fighter. I am going to ask you the questions and you are to inform me. So what God is telling him? Know your place, eh? Know who you are. I will now ask you questions. Brace yourself. Well, let me see if you could answer these questions. He said to him, Brace yourself. I am going to ask you and you. Where were you when I laid the earth's foundation? Tell me, since you are so well informed, who decided its dimensions? Do you know? Or who stretched the measuring line across it? Who supports its pillars at their bases? Who laid its cornerstones to the foundation? And then he goes on. Who pent up the sea behind closed doors? So he's now asking Job a million and one questions. And of course, Job cannot answer. Job bow in humble adoration and say, Lord, you win. I cannot answer. And he goes on asking him, do you know the mountains? Do you know when they, can you give an account? And God is their master of everything. And because again, Job maintained his perspective, he maintained his fidelity, his position before God, he, God, returned or doubled his wealth. So he started off by being very wealthy, extremely wealthy. God roughed him up. Then God said, hey, let me tell you now. Were you there? Were you there? And Job said, oh God, I can't answer all those questions. And because he was humble, because he was faithful, God doubled his fortunes. We too would like to make a journey like Job. And so we ask him, ask God to give us that patience so that we can be humble and upright before Almighty God and know our place. Were you there? Were you there? Were... Say, Master, we cannot answer that question. You are the Lord, you are our God, and we revere you. Our position, our posture is to kneel at your feet and learn, for you are gentle and humble of heart. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.